surround yourself with greatness. The people who you surround yourself with in your life are important. If you surround yourself with people who build you up, who make you grow, who challenge you to be better, you're going to become great. On the other hand, if you surround yourself with people who just tear you down, who tell you all the reasons why it's not going to work, who tell you that you're not good enough, I call people like that the little man. If you surround yourself with people who are the little man, then soon you become the little man. If they listen to their friends, if they listen to the world that was currently available to them, they would have never been successful because what they created was not possible. Where your heart, your passion can create something, it can create a new reality that didn't exist before. So you want to do things because it's the right thing to do, because you were meant to do it, because you feel it. And that comes from your heart, not because it makes logical sense to do it. You can always come up with an excuse why you can't do something. And you can say, I'm going to wait for the conditions to be perfect before I go out. The conditions are never perfect. If you wait for the conditions to be perfect to make your dream a reality, then you're going to be sitting on your dream for the rest of your life. If you want something, you go get it. Whatever you're trying to learn now, whatever new skill you're trying to pick up, the beginning stages, they're hard, it's frustrating, it sucks, but don't give up because if you keep practicing, you're going to get better and better and better and soon it won't hurt as much, you won't fall as much, you won't make as many mistakes, it's going to be easier and you'll see more results. Ignore the non-believers. If you have an idea, you're going to have people in your life who are doubters, who don't believe in what you're doing, who will tell you to do the safe thing, the smart thing, and go get a job, that your dream is just not possible. This is a stupid idea. You're going to have a lot of those people in your life, especially if you have a big idea. All you get hit with is negativity. People saying, no, 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 and telling you all the reasons why it's not going to work out. And it's so dangerous because you have a little bit of doubt yourself. And if all you hear is no, and all you see is darkness around you, at some point, this is where a lot of people fall down. This is where a lot of ideas die on the table. Because what happens is you start believing in other people and what they're saying more than you believe in yourself. You start thinking, these guys know what they're talking about. Maybe I am crazy. Maybe I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe this idea really is stupid. And you end up quitting. And then you see, a little while later, somebody else making huge dollars from your idea. And you kick yourself. And you say, that should have been me. I knew this was a good idea. But you stopped believing in yourself. And you started believing the doubters.